section E problem 4 there are a few issues in this problem like the variables A, B and C are not given and some of the values are wrong or not given in the question so first of all we will prepare this sketch and extrude it then cut these two and then cut the holes so this sketch I have already prepared with all the necessary dimensions and also you can check the variables a b and c these would be the values a is 48 b is 32 and c is 78 then these equations this is equal to b the height then the length this is equal to a and not c as given in the question then this is equal to a into 3 by 5 and this one is b by 3 so these are the four equations the sketch uh, I started from the origin I uh, made the boundary and then added this uh, chamfer and five fillets of 1.5 you can uh, make the sketch from these dimensions as shown now let's uh, extrude the sketch the length of extrusion is equal to C and not A. Now let's uh, sketch on the right plane. We can flip it by control 8. Let's sketch this profile that we need to cut. Give the dimensions. This angle is given as 24. This length is equal to B by 3. And this length is equal to B by 4. Let's make a center line to mirror this. Select everything and mirror. Now let's go to extrude it cut. We can cut through all both. Now come on this surface to sketch. You can create a center line and a circle from the center. The dimension is 8 mm. Then another circle. This would be equal to this circle. And vertical. And this distance from this edge is given as 12. Select the circle and this line and we can mirror. Now let's go to extrude cut. The cut is 10 mm. So we can take blind and 10 mm. Now just add the chamfers three into one point five by forty five so one point five mm three chamfers done now let's apply the material this is cast carbon steel apply let's check the mass 516.93 let's check with the answer 516.73 so this is correct there might be a slight variation due to method but this is correct so next part in the next video thank you